this on the papers? I don't know. Hey everybody, this is A-Track, live and direct from uh, Bangkok, Thailand. Back for another hotel review. I gotta hurry up because I'm a little bit late for the airport, but um, you people are important to me. It's very important in this economy to be aware of the different types of hotel rooms in Southeast Asia. Um, so, this is uh, the Fraser Suites Hotel, which is conveniently located right next to the club where I played last night, which is Q Bar. Um, and then this room is nice, it's roomy, it's got uh, plenty of space, it feels like an apartment, hence the name Suites. It's called Fraser Suites. No relation to Fraser Crane and no relation to my sweet tooth. Um, so, I'm going to go right for the gold, people. I'm going to cut to the chase right now. This is amazing. When you live on tour and you're constantly counting your socks every day, um, laundry becomes the most complicated thing in the world. You land, into, you land in a city, you go straight to the hotel, you do a little bit of work, you eat, you do your gig, next thing you know, the day's over and it's the same thing the next day again. To fit laundry in there, to find a place that can clean, wash and, wash and fold as they call it, um, during the brief window that you're in a city is next to impossible and laundry becomes uh, a task of Obama proportions. So when you show up at a hotel and there's a washer slash dryer with detergent and everything and you can just wash all your clothes without even thinking about it, it's your lucky day. When you walk out of said hotel and you run into two elephants in the streets, which is what happened to me when I got here yesterday, it's doubly lucky day. Um, maybe triple if you count two for the two elephants and one for the laundry. Triple lucky day yesterday when I got in here. Bangkok, this has been a good stay. Let's look around the room a little bit. Uh, yeah, this was an article in the paper. This is my hat. You've seen it before. This is something that I did uh, when I was just, I had a little bit of downtown yes, downtime yesterday and there was a blank canvas. And, you know, some people say that life is a blank canvas. So I felt inspired and I started painting. Uh, the, the blue represents um, Colgate toothbrush, toothpaste, I mean, and the, the white represents that uh, Arm & Hammer brand whitening toothpaste, and the yellow represents the tartar buildup on your teeth, and, and then the red is your gums, and, 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 and the brown is just poop, I was, there was no more toilet paper, so yeah, it's a little something I did, you know, a little something I did. Uh, this looks really cool. I, I, I think it's an amp of some sort. I, I guess I'm a DJ slash producer. I should know what it is. I didn't try it. Forgot about it. Um, but it's nice. Uh, rug. Rug. Psychedelic rug. The walls are bleeding. I love when a hotel room, uh, when a hotel gives you robes and slippers. His and hers, to be noted. Bathroom is nice, roomy, bathtub, shower. No complaints, loves it. Truly um, a superior hotel, Fraser Suites. I am entirely satisfied. Nice view on stuff and more stuff. Can't see any elephants right now, but it's only a question of time. So I'm off to the airport. Bangkok, it's been fun. I'm going to Hong Kong, and then the next day I'm going to Macau, and the next day I'm going to Osaka. I don't even know where I am anymore. But uh, thanks for tuning in, and now we're about to tune out.